Hey guys, welcome back. I am Jason. I'm going to be building a small little walking path, small little bridge across a pretty substantial. We're gonna be doing some sort of footpath because a lady, the only way she can get to her property is by wading the creek and she's probably, I don't know, 60s. And, um, and the, the weather's getting cold and it's probably not a good idea for her to be wading across a slippery, rocky, fast flowing stream. If we can help it, so we're just gonna give her a little, a little yeah. path. I got a little makeshift bridge. Oh, okay. We just need a good, a good angle to so get it high. Hidden in, if it hits the bank, we're yeah. done. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Lots of people have been affected by this stuff. Lots of people have seen some pretty terrible things and experienced a lot of terrible things and lost a lot of things, lost everything, lost loved ones. And it's just gonna take a long time for recovery just not just physically but emotionally as well so lots of prayers to go to them uh if you want to help man a lot of people want to help a lot of people have been reaching out and asking for ways that they can help and volunteer and all those things donations the, the u.s men's academy which is the nonprofit that i'm working with are all good ones to donate to and we are we are working like right now the u.s men's academy is, is working on uh taking the donations that people have sent to us and we're working on best uh, the best placement for those funds like for example we purchased some starlinks and we were able to give those out um to people that were are, just have zero communications at the moment because there's you know, they're running off generator power and there's uh just there's nothing so they can't talk to their families and and that kind of stuff so worked on that <laughs> we're working on buying some campers for some people to at least give them some temporary housing until they have a more permanent solution some t in some situations, kind of what we're looking for is people that have just been left completely homeless and now they're staying with friends or family and we're really looking for those people basically. So uh, if you have any leads on that, you can let us know. That's about what I thought was going to happen. <laughs> so we got it. It did pretty well. That's about what I expected. But it's uh, it's right there on the bank. No, I think we might be able to get a little bit more out of it. Here you go, Princess. Is he younger? Yeah, he's, we're 40 and he's 37. You're 37, right, Tate? 35. Oh, okay. 35. That was a car. That was a Ford truck. On top of the big bar. I think this is like the, the fulcrum though, you know what I mean? Okay. What do you think of that? Yeah, yeah. You got one. All right. So 
You can go to do a lot of things. You can sign up to help and register in a lot of places. One of the things that we've created is bccdisasterrelief.com. So in this area right here, you can go to bccdisasterrelief.com and you can sign up as a volunteer, put down your skills, the tools that you have, and you can um, hopefully get paired up with a work party. And that was good. <laughs> I went way further than I thought it was going to do the first fall. I think we're in business. We got a shovel. Uh, Let's uh Jesus. How about that log right there but yeah. safe. That's all I got. <laughs> I'm just thinking of mounting the next one. They've done it with mules instead of trucks, but yeah, whatever. Whatever you want to do, Princess, I'll let you make that call. Uh, I really don't care, babe. Actually, bring it out farther? Yeah, if you can. Yeah, maybe. Not as good. I can clean that up. Got a lot of character. <laughs> 